small YouTubers, I'll tell you something right now. These big YouTubers are not thinking about us. Don't get me wrong. This doesn't mean they're bad people. This doesn't mean they're inadequate. This doesn't mean we should be bashing them. I've seen a lot of small YouTubers complain about YouTube and big YouTubers not helping them out or not doing enough for the YouTube community or whatever. Enough's enough now. That's over. Let's cancel that. Let's cancel that right now. That's over. Why? Because they're not thinking about us. I'm not saying that every now and then you might get some help from a big YouTuber if you know them or they're feeling, you know, you you you, you want to wait until they feeling like, you know, they want to help you one day, this one random day because they're feeling good, the, the sun is shining bright on their face. And they're like, you know, let me go help a YouTuber out. Don't get wrong, that's all fine and dandy. That's cool, but you want to wait for that? I don't. Now, me personally, for real, for real, it, it don't it don't really matter to me whether I get big or not on this YouTube. I've told you guys this before. I've told all my subscribers, any YouTuber that's ever listened to certain videos, I've told you this before. Now, why do I say really? Because the reason why I say really because I'm a guy that's a motivator. I'm a guy that I don't want to say preaches, but says and speaks, you know, never giving up. Now, am I on the brink of giving up because I'm not where I think I should be or my subscribers are not where uh, I'm not where my subscribers think I should be? Nah, I'm not on the brink of giving up. I love playing Madden. So whenever I, whenever the game comes out, I get the game and I, I, I'll play Madden. You know what I mean? Because I'm, I'm going to play it anyway, so why not post it? You know what I mean? I'm going to play it. So so that will always be on the channel, Madden and NBA 2K. You know what I mean? Uh, if, if my channel was something different, then maybe, then maybe I, would, I wouldn't give, I wouldn't be giving up, but I might not be as eager to post because it's not you guys get what I'm saying but that's not the point I'm trying to make here they are not going to do they're not looking to do anything for us they're not thinking about us us small YouTubers I know you're asking okay well LP then what do we do then if they're not going to help us we're not going to we're not going to come up I think that's false what we got to do is we got to help each other out you know whatever you're doing make up you tell stories and you're jumping off a roost and you, you, you're floating on clouds and you're surfing on clouds or whatever you're doing, Madden NBA 2K. If you see a YouTuber that's around your subscriber range or around a range you think it's feasible or they seem like someone that would talk to you and, and show you some love, show them some love. Be the, make, be the person to make the first attempt. Everybody wants to sit back and wait for things to happen to them. That's not how life works. Life doesn't always go, work the way you think it's going to work or the way it should work. They're not going to give nothing to us. We got to take it. Period. We got to take it. We got to take it by helping each other. That's how we come up. We help each other out. You know, we continue to help each other out. Uh, you might not necessarily like a person's video that you subscribe to, but you just wanted to show them some love. That mean you can't go and smash the like button and leave a nice comment every now and then. Once every five videos, once every three videos. We keep showing each other love. And don't get into this funk where all oh, this person ain't showing me love, so I'm not going to show them love. They might be going through a phase. You don't know what they're going through in their life. And I mean, like, see, right now, I'm posting videos like this because I got a sewage problem. So my base, my, my man cave is uh, being redone right now. Yeah, I told you guys about this. My man cave is being redone. So if I'm not, you know, hitting the like button on, on videos as consistently as I usually do, it don't mean I'm not liking your videos. It just means I'm just, I'm going through something in life right now and I got to take care of it. And when I get back, we're going to get the, the love going to come back. Stop being so sensitive. Some of y'all are too sensitive. You, you're too quick to react and not quick enough to think. Some of these big YouTubers are using this, this YouTube thing as their livelihood. So of course they got to focus on that. Now, they're not, I, I can't speak for them, but I, I, I don't think all of them are have this thing where some of them probably do feel entitled. I'm not going to say they don't, they don't feel entitled because, you know, then it came up. You know, some of them probably done did some wacky stuff to come up. We're not going to delve in. Matter of fact, I know some of them have done some wacky stuff to come up. I will say that, but we're not going to dive too deep into that. You know, we're not going to get that deep into it. But, you know, the point of it is, the point of this video is that we got to help each other up. We got to outwork them. You know, some of us don't post consistently enough and are complaining. You know, we got to outwork them. We got to outsmart them. We got to outthink them. We got to work together and come up together. That's the only way it's going to happen. If not, if we stay segregated and we stay complaining about YouTube not coming up, 
you know, we're just going to be in the same spot for a long time. Don't get me wrong. Every once in a while, one of us might come up or one of us might do something. You know, you never know. You know what I mean? But that's the thing. You get one You get one that'll come up and do something and forget about the other guys. Now, I'm not necessarily saying that, you know, but I, what I am saying is that we shouldn't look for no handouts. You know what I mean? And I was saying, I'm, not, I'm definitely not looking for no handouts. I said, if a YouTuber, if a big YouTuber seen my channel and he was like, oh, this dude's working pretty hard. Let me give him a hand. And that's cool. It could happen. I'm not going to wait for it, though. You know what I mean? I pretty much got my, my, my you. I got I got a lot of cats in my YouTube. Well, nah, I, I got some cats that I consider YouTube fam. You know, Engraven, Rain and Raven. I'm rocking with, I'm rocking with them, man. You know, I, I, Ionic Freeze. You know, I'm rocking with them. You know what I mean? Because we've been rocking, we've been showing each other love for a long time now. You know what I mean? So, I'm just, this is suggesting for me, man. The only reason why I'm putting this video out because I've seen a lot of videos where these small YouTubers are complaining about what's going on. Don't get me wrong, I understand the frustration. Look at my channel. I know I feel, I know I seem calm on the surface, but look at my channel. I got over 1,100 videos and I only got 4,000 subscribers. Eventually, I'm going to have more videos than, than subscribers. That's a joke, but you never know. <laughs> you know, you never know. So, if I can, if I can weather the storm peacefully and just fight, just fight the good fight until the light comes, then you can too. Your boy, remember, you're not giving us anything. We gotta take it.